So today I'm going to be showing you my favorite, favorite thing right now and it's actually the coolest thing ever. I'm going to be doing a Tumblr inspired makeup tutorial using only one product for my eyes which is just like a bonus because I know when you're first getting into makeup sometimes it's like really overwhelming when you watch these people do makeup tutorials like every second day and they're using all new products every second day and you're just like what the heck I only don't want that so anyways I know the feeling I've been there I'm still there I'm yeah this is going to be with white eyeliner now don't be afraid just watch the tutorial or look at my face right now and tell me I don't look crazy because I know I don't look crazy although I am wearing orange lipstick so maybe a little crazy I want to show you guys something that I love to wear but it's also something that a lot of people like which is Tumblr. People love Tumblr. I love Tumblr. I think Tumblr's awesome. Tumblr, Tumblr. I like to say it too. So if you don't follow me on Tumblr, I'll put my link down below. I absolutely love it. There are some amazing photos on that website and I thought that I would sort of try to do my best to sort of make a look that I've seen before. I tried to make it a little more practical, so hopefully you guys enjoyed this. Let me know if you liked it. Let me know if you try it. Let me know what you think. So I hope you guys enjoy. Thank you so much for watching. Let's get into the tutorial. All right, so first I have to create a flawless face, so I'm going to be applying my regular foundation all over my face and then using my usual brush that I use pretty much in every tutorial to do my foundation. Um, I pretty much show my foundation in every video, like how I do it, so if you want to see how I do my foundation, I'll link my most recent tutorial while I show it, but this video I just decided to kind of leave it out. But anyways, so gotta get a flawless face, gotta, gotta start with that. Next, I'm going to apply a eye primer. This is going to make the eyeliner I'm using last a really long time and make it pop. Alright, so time for my white eyeliner. Time to sharpen it first though. I'm going to be applying that right to my upper eyelashes, which you cannot see because my hand's in the way. But I am doing that, so, ooh, yeah, sorry the hand, it's kind of annoying, but, oh, here you can see. So I'm just applying that to my upper lash line and also to the lower lash line below the lashes. So before blending it out, I do look a little crazy, but I'm just going to take a nice warm finger and I'm going to blend that into the skin. I'm not rubbing it away, but I am blending it so that it's not so stark and white, just like white, you know, you know? So blend that out till it looks a little bit more natural. Next, I'm going to be using this white matte eyeshadow and I'm going to put that underneath my eyebrow. And I love that because it adds a little highlight, and looks a little fancy, a little schmancy. I'm also going to be putting that on my cupid's bow. Time to curl my eyelashes. I curl only one eyelash set because the other ones are like permanently curled. It's weird. I don't know why. But then I'm going to apply mascara and I love this mascara. It's a little bit more volumizing. It's a little bit more clumpy, but I kind of like that than my other mascaras. Then I'm just going to take that white eyeliner again and line my waterline. Then I'm going to take mascara and apply it just to the roots of my bottom eyelashes. I don't want to extend it all the way out because I really want my eyes to stay really wide open. So I find that for myself, just putting in the roots makes my eyes look bigger. As for lips, I really wanted to use a nice bold color, so I decided to use this red, um, really, really true red color, and I love the way it looks. I think it's always really important to clean up your mouth area after applying red lipstick, so I'm just going to take some concealer on this little concealer brush, clean up around the edges. 
as for cheeks, I really wanted to go hard on the bronzer today. Um, don't really know where that came from. I just had like an inner feeling of like bronzerness, bronzer everywhere. So I really wanted to focus it closer to my hairline. Um, but as you can see, I'm just doing a regular contour sort of thing. You guys all know how to do it, I'm sure. So. I also brought the contour up onto my temples to make my face look a bit slimmer. I do have a very square face, so it's kind of nice, but anyways, for blush, I'm just using my favorite blush and applying that to the apples of my cheeks. I seriously love this blush so much, it seriously brightens up my face, and I just, I just love it. Alright, so with the red lip, that is the finished tutorial. But Emily is never satisfied with her tutorials, so she decided to change up the lip color to this orange little lipstick color. I really like this color as well. It completely changes the look in my opinion, so it's really up to you, but that is it. Thanks for watching!